What's up, Falcons? Happy Friday. I'm Cecilia, and first up, we got Bobby with the weather. Welcome to this week's weather report. I'm Bobby, and for this week, Friday will be 47, mostly cloudy, and Saturday, the lights will be way down low. Let it snow, let snow, let snow, with Saturday being a 44, rain and snow, and Sunday being a 48 with showers. And for our next segment, we have sports! Welcome back, Falcons. I'm Cannon. I'm Hunter. And we're going to be catching you up with all last week's scores and all upcoming events. That's cool. Over Thanksgiving break, all four teams played at Mount Shasta. JV girls won 45-21. Varsity boys lost 33-45. Varsity girls won 71-21. Varsity boys lost 54 to 73. On Monday, both girls played Calusa at home. JV girls won 35 to 22. Varsity girls won 60 to 41. Good job, ladies. Basketball. On Tuesday, JV and Varsity girls played Corny at Corny. JV girls won 30 to 22, and Varsity girls won 65 to 31. On Tuesday, all three boys played at Orland. Freshmen lost 17 to 63. JV lost 33 to 67 and Varsity lost 29 to 63. That's it for this week, Falcons. Once again, I'm Cannon. I'm Hunter. And we'll see you next week. Thanks, sports dudes. Next up, we got ASB. Hey, Falcons. Hope you guys had a great week. Thank you for all who came to the game on Monday. It was great to have you guys all there supporting us. We have another home game next week. Varsity girls and JV girls play Pierce. JV starts at 5.30 and Varsity starts at 7. The theme has not been decided, so we'll get posters that get put out on Monday and look on the Instagram page. Hope to see you guys there. Next week is also Rally in the Valley, which means it's Spirit Week. Monday will be PJs. Tuesday will be Christmas headwear. Wednesday will be Cowboy Christmas. Thursday will be movie, Christmas movie character. Friday will be your colors, and we're doing it a little bit different. It'll be freshmen are white, sophomores are now red, juniors are going to be green, and seniors are going to be all three. Also, we will be having a tournament, and our boys will be playing in it, so make sure to go check that out and watch them play next weekend. And we are going to have a rally next week, so be ready and be ready to have some fun. Thank you. Thank you so much, ASB. Now for an international student interview. Hello Falcons, I'm here with another interview. And first, we're gonna start off, if you wanna list your name and country of origin again. If you don't remember, last week we did a large interview with a lot of our foreign exchange students and now we're doing individual ones, so. Uh, my name is Ava and I'm from Estonia. Okay, now first, tell me about your hometown and I guess your favorite place there, just about. Um, my favorite place in my hometown is like the small hill, uh, it's a fun place and you get great views there, uh, it's really small area, most of the people know everyone who lives there and all that, and that's basically it. <laughs> and what do you like to do with your spare time when you're not working on all of the schoolwork and all that once you're finally free to just do whatever you want? Uh, basically what I like to do on my free time is uh, read books and dance. Oh cool, how long have you been doing that for? Uh, I've been dancing for 11 years, I think. Wow, that's really awesome. And if you could travel anywhere in the world right now, where would you go and why? Under the water Bermuda Triangle. And why Bermuda Triangle to be specific? It seems an interesting place. Yeah, there's a lot of like special, interesting things about them, not just the legends, but also their climate and all of that. Well, thank you so much for taking your time out of your day, and have a great rest of your day. Thank you. That was awesome. Next up, there's some information about our school's current canned food drive. Hi, I'm Riley. I'm from the Women's Empowerment Club. Hi, and I'm Sam. I'm from the Key Club. 
So um, the Women's Empowerment Club and Key Club are coming together to um, host a canned food drive. Um, all the proceeds are going to be going to One Safe Place. Um, it ends on December 16th. And um, yeah, just um, go ahead and bring any extra food if you got any. Uh, yeah, thank you. That's good to know. We should all do our part. Next up, we have our segment with Miss Lane. Good morning, Falcons. Um, once again, just a couple quick announcements. Um, great job. I saw the results of the PSAT results. Um, good job to all those who participated. Way to try, make an effort. Um, some of our students did an excellent job. You know who you are. Um, if you haven't seen your results, please check those out. Also, this next week, we have Department of Bureau Affairs coming to our school to check out what our foreign exchange students have been up to and to see our campus. So you'll see some guests next Thursday out and about um, seeing what we're doing here at CV and how we're acclimating all our foreign exchange students to the American lifestyle. Um, lastly, we have a lot of sports going on. Um, we have wrestling and basketball traveling um, this weekend, so good luck to all of you. Next week, we have dress-up days for Rally in the Valley. Remember, everything for dress-up days is school appropriate, um, and we're meeting those dress code expectations. And lastly, Rally in the Valley is going to be quickly approaching. Hope to see you all here cheering on our teams. Um, do good this weekend, all our sports teams, and have a great weekend. Thanks. Thanks, Mrs. Lane. Now, have a great weekend, everybody, and I'll see y'all next time.